All right. I told you fucking assholes. I told you guys about Mr. Beast. And nobody believed me about that motherfucker. I knew it. I knew that guy's a fucking uh, up to no good. No one you guys believe me about it. All you guys are like, oh, he's a nice guy. He's a really great person. And all this other shit. Blah, 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 blah. Now it's come out he's a fucking pedophile and does all this fucked up weird shit. See, I told it all, all these years. And none of you motherfuckers believe me. He's a fraud. He's a pedophile. Now everybody's coming out about him. Now, now he's fucking screwed. I, I, I hope he goes to fucking jail. That'd be fucking hilarious. Put that motherfucker in uh, fucking jail f- with uh, fucking uh, P. Diddy and uh, the other asshole, uh, fucking uh, Harvey Weinstein and all of them. <laughs> R. Kelly. And them. That'd be fucking hilarious. Fucking uh, share the cell with fucking a P. Diddy. Yeah, R. Kelly and them, man. That'd be fucking hilarious as hell. I, I told you about that motherfucker. I told you he does weird shit. The fucking big ass buck tooth beaver teeth looking motherfucker. Hey, Beaker Peas, you guys a great guy. He wouldn't do anything wrong to anybody. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking told you guys that guy's a goddamn phony. I told a lot about him, the weird shit he did, and. None of you guys believe me. Oh, 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 he's, he's, he's... Samuel's just joking around about Mr. Beast. He's not, like, fucking around with that. He's a, a, a really good guy, and he's Samuel just being an asshole. <laughs> oh, that's it for Mr. Beast. That's it. That motherfucker gets canceled. No more Feast Bowls. No more Mr. Beast burgers. I heard, even though I heard those places suck balls and make shitty burgers. You got poor establishment and shitty employees. Worse than McDonald's, so yeah, that, that, that guy's going down the gutter. That, that's it for him. But no more, no more of this goofy, uh, stupid show shit. All this fake ass videos of oh, he gave money to the poor people and people off the streets and everything all that other shit. <laughs> I told you about that shit too. You give no fucking money to these people and all this other stuff. I remember before everyone was like defending him on fucking uh, Instagram and Facebook when all these his uh, his friends like left the uh, fucking uh, business and shit, left the industry. They're like, ah, fuck Mr. Beast. That guy's a fucking asshole. They they said about Mr. Beast and all these fans in the comments are like, oh, well, fuck you too, dude. Mr. Beast don't need you anymore. Now all this stuff's coming about him because his uh, fruitcake friend did all this weird shit, and Mr. Beast said what was fine of him doing all that. So now he's now he's fucked himself over for keeping that fruitcake on, on that fucking shelf for a long time. <sighs> all comes to fucking place. All comes to place. After all these years, I was right. I was fucking right about the guy. I was fucking right. Oh man, this is a great year, man! All these people are getting exposed. It has, it has to be Mr. Beast too. That's like the best part about it is Mr. Beast. And now, all we need is now is the Paul brothers get canceled because those fucking stupid prime drinks, like fucking, that's just not good for you. All that fucking sugar and all that shit in there, it, like who the fuck wants to drink all that? That's just not good for you. That shit get you diabetes in no time. Fucking uh, those energy drinks. I don't fuck with energy drinks because like I have I have too much energy already. If I drink that shit, I'll go fucking crazy. I will lose my fucking mind. I, I can't I can't touch that shit. Prime, Monster, Red Bull. I I, I, can't, I can't fuck with that shit. No way. I don't know how all these other people my age can fuck with this shit like that. Mix it with fucking like alcohol and stuff like that. What what the fuck's the matter if you're doing that? Are you are you you want to fucking die in the hospital or something? Fucking mentally retarded motherfucker. Do all this goofy shit. Why can't you just drink regular fucking booze or or regular liquor? Why you gotta fucking mix shit with energy stuff? Like, are you serious with that? I'm not really much of a drinker anyway, so. I don't drink. I don't drink. I don't smoke. I I don't do shit like that. I'm just just one of those people that just don't do that type of stuff. I just... I'm just a chill-ass dude. I'm not no alcoholic or a weed smoker or all that other shit. But, uh, yeah, Mr. Beast, yeah, the guy's a pedophile and, uh, he's a fraud, like I said. I, I told you guys the guy's a phony. He's a phony baloney, and no, I know I believed you a long time ago. 
Everyone's like, oh, he's just joking around. Samuel's just fucking around. He, he's just joking. <laughs> we don't believe him. <laughs> oh, Samuel, you're very funny. You know, Mr. Beast's a good guy. He, he wouldn't do stuff like that. He helps people. He does a lot of nice things for everybody. <laughs> Ah, uh, plus it's like raining outside too. Also, it is sunny at the same time. Oh, that's, that's that's another good sign right there of you know Mr. Beast being exposed. You know, ah, oh, you get to see some beautiful rainbows today. Feel the rainbow and taste the rainbow. You know, and not even more for for that uh, Chris Tyson guy anymore. You you be feeling tasting no rainbows anymore. You tasting all that those dicks in prison, and I'll tell you that. He likes that shit anyway, so what the fuck I'm talking about? What the fuck am I talking about?